The city of Newberry will no longer pick up trash from commercial businesses. This news is bringing mixed reactions from local business owners. News 19's Becky Buds has the story. A change in the city of Newberry's trash collection is forcing some businesses like Whitaker Floor Coverings to find new services. Kevin Whitesides is the VP of Sales. Uh, we've had three different salesmen in here anywhere offering from a one-year contract to a 10-year contract to do it, matching the price or even better pricing. So that seems to be pretty seamless. After reviewing the offers, Whitesides decided on a 10-year contract that starts August 1st. We, we, we felt great to be able to lock a price in for multiple years with the, everything rising. <laughs> Director of Public Works Kip Gunter says rising labor, equipment and drop off costs force the city to get out of the commercial sanitation business. When a truck is about 400,000 um, and those costs keep rising, it, we feel like our customers could be served better by free market. According to Gunter, current city commercial customers were notified by letter last week. Customers have until September 30th to hire a new service. Any company that is not switched by then may have to pay a penalty. There will be no customer left behind, so to speak. We will make sure that everything's seamless. Gunter adds customers have four service providers to choose from. Business owners like Midge Bullyard, who shares a trash bin with eight other businesses, are worried about the changes. Um, I think it's a great convenience to the business owners. I think it's really disturbing to think that they would take it out and that we would all be responsible for our own. I think there are certainly other viable solutions. The city will continue providing other services, including residential collection, limb and leaf removal, and special pickups. Reporting in Newberry, Becky Buds, News 19, WLTX. While well, City Council also recently approved utility rate increases, it includes a 5% increase on water and sewer consumption and a 4% increase on electric.